how's it going? Swatch with me. 12 Sharpie brush pens. Go grab your stuff. I mean, hit pause, go grab your stuff, and come back and hit play. What are you swatching today? Okay, this is the case. I've had these for, oh, a couple of years, I'd say. And I thought, well, let me swatch these. I need some quick swatch with me videos. There are only 12 of these. I just now put them into the order that I want them to be in. Uh, so we have pink and light red, believe it or not. Red, orange, yellow, light green. Green, light blue, blue, purple. Although this might come out like a lavender. But I'm not really going to go by the cap because that's always a bad idea. And then brown and black. Although black, we could, I think we could go with. <laughs> These are brush pens, right? And they are... Uh, they are water-based. These are not permanent. So, we have the brush pen. <clears throat> and they still work, which is awesome. And the swatch card du jour is... Uh, is <laughs> uh, contains mustaches. So, these are the Mr. Pen mustaches. And they are from the Mr. Pen stencil that I have that has this mustache. Um, it doesn't have all mustaches on it, but I think it has like landscaping or house and house and garden uh, stencils on it. And then somewhere on that big stencil template, there's this little mustache thing. I thought, hey, I'm gonna do that for this because these are pretty small brush, the brush tips here. So, and I tried it out one with, I think with the pink, so we're going to see how 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 well I can stay in the lines. Now this swatch card is being propped up by two books. And I guess I'll have to show you what those books are. I know you're itching to know. Two big thick books. But now if I go out of the lines, please don't worry. I mean, it's only a swatch card. It's nothing to write home about. All right, I was getting ready to do the other one. That's not too bad, actually. <laughs> awesome. But I wanted to put them up on books because I really don't want you to see my graying hair. And it's probably all over the place today because I didn't really style it for this shindig. For this swatch with me shindig, right? Is that what it's called? There will soon, I think, I don't know if it'll come out before this one, but uh, there will be a video where I made swatch swatch cards. I just did two of them and filled up the whole page with different shapes. And I'm not going to put them back into their little straps because it takes a little bit too long. Yeah, that's not too bad for... It really looks like red, right? So what is this, dark red then? I had to run these two colors. Oh no, this is red. It's a good thing I labeled it correctly. So I had to, to swatch these, so to speak. Just draw a little line on the paper. Like, what color is this? What color is that? This almost looks like vermilion. Okay, let me do that. Okay, this one is orange. You can see if the crafty cat lady can stay in the lines. Just so you know, I'm not very good at staying in the lines because I got this motto. <laughs> Maybe you remember what it is. You know, why be normal? That's a nice orange. Okay, this one is yellow. That 
black better not come off. This is a, the black pen I use for this is a permanent micron black pen. I think it was 0 0.3 millimeter. I think I might have to get a new one too because I was writing the names out here and I was thinking, hey, are, is this thing going out on me because of the bees? I was when I was drawing, drawing when I was writing the bees, it didn't seem to come out right. Very light, and I thought, oh no. I do. I think I do have another point three millimeter pen, micron pen. Oh, this one almost looks like it might be drying. Beauteous. Get some touch ups there. <laughs> okay. Green. I hope. I say I hope. <laughs> I really don't use these enough. I should use these more often because I like the brush pens. I when I look at alcohol ink markers, for example, I try and go after those markers that have brush ends to them as opposed to chisel and nib. Uh I look for I guess I look for chisel and brush. Chisel and nib. Aren't they all called nibs? I guess they are. Chisel and and brush as opposed to chisel and... What is it? Point? Oh, I like this. Now, see, this one I kind of made a mistake with the black pen. But that's okay because it kind of gives it a little bit of dimension to it. Dimension. <laughs> Not dimension, <laughs> the way it should be. That was maybe loud, I'm sorry. I'm throwing my pens around, my markers. Ooh, I'm gonna try these in, in the coloring books I have. This one is blue. Now see, I went out of the line. I'm just not taking my time. Ta da Yes, that's blue. That was loud. Purple or lavender, I don't know. Oh no, this is purple. Or violet if you prefer that over purple. Violet is so much more sophisticated, right? Now you're going out of lines, Tammy. That's a little sloppy. I apologize. Or do I? <laughs> That's a very dark purple. I'm thinking Sharpie needs to change the cap color on that one. This is brown. Oh, that's my hand scraping. Now, this is cardstock that I'm drawing on today or coloring. It is heavyweight cardstock. Okay, and last but never least, black.
Those handlebar mustaches, that's what they are. All right, let's look at it a little more closely. Not too fast, I hope that's not too fast. That really is only 12 markers. I don't have a practice card for this. Wow, this is the practice card and the final product. <laughs> okay, I think that's it. Uh, I don't I don't remember how much these cost. They were relatively inexpensive, they're Sharpies. Uh, they do say brush pen on the, on the label here where they show the color here and the color on the cap. And don't always go with what the cap says as far as color goes and that goes not just with sharpies but with any marker or any kind of even colored pencils that have don't go with just what the barrel shows uh it's because it's almost never the same color that comes out of that pencil or out of that marker so i'm gonna put those right there Please comment, like, share, and subscribe. Thanks for watching, and have an artistic day. Bye.